Howdy, everybody, and welcome in. Today we're going to Hope County, Montana, on a new adventure through a new game. Well, not new, it's been out for a while, but I've never played it, so it's new for me. We're going in to try out Far Cry 5. Apparently, there is a militant group of uh, religious fanatics that have set up root, uh, set up shop here, and uh, I'm a feeling we're going to have to deal with them. So without further ado, welcome in, hope you're all well. We're going to get started in this uh, first playthrough and first episode of Far Cry 5. We'll go with normal, and uh, we're going to pick this character. Now, I played, like, a very little of this game, so I'm not, like, 100% sure what to expect. I haven't really, you know, done it all. I have not made it much past the intro. Montana. Big sky country. Absolutely Treasure beautiful state. state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. Good day to you, brother. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were well, that's the problem. They don't take them seriously. Seriously. Militant. It was a goddamn cult. Gee, you think? Us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state. Built right here. Under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. We, we government can't do shit. We're on our own. Fans, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. This guy's a little nutty. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. It's David Crash with a man bun. We don't know what he's capable of. How? Who? Their leader. Joseph C. They call him the father. Those in the outside world are blind. Do not believe. I have no faith, but I will make them see. Well, if you're, you're gonna make them see, sir, doing that to somebody is, is not gonna make them see anything. Hey, rookie. Rookie. And that would Waste be me. Time. There's no signal out here. I am the rookie. These are U.S. Marshals. And that is some real hubris right there. That's, that's some real conceit. We're officially in Peggy country. How much longer? Peggy Sue? long enough for you to change your mind. So we can turn this bird around. You want me to ignore a federal warrant, Sheriff? No, sir. I want you to understand the reality of this situation. Joseph C. This is not gonna go well. White horse to dispatch over. Corrado. We're approaching the compound, Nancy. Over. Roger, Sheriff. You still planning to go through with this? Over. We are. Unfortunately, still trying to talk some sense in our friend Marshall. Over. Didn't they say in the uh, opening that they had the law enforcement in their pocket? Sheriff? We're here. Compound's 
pretty serious, uh, pretty serious looking place they got there. I somehow doubt he'd be doing that. I I just don't see him doing that. I swear overwhelming force should be applied. Yeah, overwhelming force should be applied. We should lift off right now. You don't hear from us in 15 minutes. Send in everyone. Call the goddamn National Guard if you have to. Over. Now listen up. Did she just say she'd be praying for us? That does not sound good. Got it. Rookie! Alright, everyone. Stay sharp. Let's go! Uh This is bad. This is a bad idea, sir. Uh, I know you've got this warrant, but uh Alright. You'll be in the church. Stick close. Alright. These folks can spook. Look at these. Go about your business. This doesn't concern you. Jim, I don't like this. Everything's fine. Uh, I mean, this is how it's horror movies fun. start, all right? Jesus Christ. You're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges in here. They'll respect the There's this new content after liberating Dutch's Island and fully installed. I've already fully installed the title, all right? Lots of dogs. That's wonderful. Lots of crazies. I apparently have a whole bunch of stuff I got with this game, so we're gonna we'll, we'll look at that when I have access to it. Calmly, you got it. Fine. Hudson on the door. Watch our backs. Don't let any of these people get in. Rookie, on me. And you, just try not to do anything stupid. Yeah, uh, I Relax. don't have any faith in him. You're about to get your name in the paper. I, I don't have any faith in him doing anything but fine. stupid. Something is coming. You can feel it, can you? We are creeping toward the edge. And there will be a reckoning. This guy's and voice. We'll start the project. Because we know what happens next. They will come. Try to take from us, take our guns, take our freedom, take our faith. We will not let them. Sheriff, sure, come on, hold on. Bro. We will not let their greed or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore. Listen, this dude looks like there the lead singer for a Christian prog rock band or some shit. Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. Uh, yeah, that, that's, uh, that's a face of crazy right there. There they are. The locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. these crazy crazy people man first scene that i heard as it were the noise of thunder one of the four beasts say come and see step forward and i saw yeah yeah and behold it was a white horse and hell followed with it rookie Uh, yeah, 
we'll see about that, sir. You are under arrest. Sometimes the best thing to do is to walk away. I mean... And come back with overwhelming force. Let's go. Took the father, all right. Out of the way, folks. Nothing to see here. Coming through. Back up. Back up. I just wanted to question the man. We're taking him in. Stay out of the way. Everyone Stand down. Back. Get yourself some new clothes. Have a hot shower. Some of you smell like you ain't bathed in a week. He's gonna be fine. We ain't shot any of you. Quit throwing rocks and cans at us, please. And come on, let's get him in the trouble. Come on, come on, get, get in there. What are you people doing? Quit, please, please, let go of the chopper. Quit hanging off the chopper, sir. Yeah, that's not gonna end well for you. Yeah, no, that's what you get. Yeah. Uh, why, why is that person on the on the on the on the front? Why are you on the windshield? What are you doing? What are you? Did you just you just jumped in the? Ah uh, hell! You just jumped into the rotor blade that flung you both off, and uh, we're 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 spinning, spinning. Yeah. That did not help things at all. That kind of hurt. Uh, uh. Okay, wait a minute. Where's the sheriff? Is the sheriff? Oh, it's crazy eyes. It's crazy eyes. Okay, sir. I don't think God inspired your person to jump into the rotor blade of the helicopter? Dispatch. Everything is just fine here. I don't need to call anyone. Yes, Father. Praise be to you. Really? Really? She's she's on yeah, that figures. She's probably gonna need killing. Wait, wait, no, I, I'm, I'm, I'm just a rookie. Oh, shit. Run. Jesus 
See, now, now if God had wanted you to have us, that would not have happened. I'm going to say that right now. So see how that works? Ugh, come on. Oh, this is a you know, long struggle with a seatbelt. Always a long struggle with a seatbelt. Oh, I'm getting the heck out of here. Let's go. Ah, no, 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 no. Quit shooting at me. Look, I am getting... Look, sir, quit shooting at me. Uh, I hear dogs barking. I hear Peggy screaming. Assassin's Creed level. Assassin's Creed level dive. Leap of faith into the water. Suddenly, we've lost him. Just like that. That's amazing. What's this? Okay, we're gonna have to. Oh, we got a we got a branch. Okay, we're armed. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to be careful though. Oh, Jesus Christ! I see him right there. I think we can avoid most of them. Okay, detection meter fills up as I spot you. When close enough and undetected, you press F to perform a takedown. Okay, cool. Uh Okay, um Where'd the handgun go? I thought I got a handgun off this guy. Yeah. No. There, we got it that time. Oh, we'll we'll take a pipe too. Uh, typical looting. Eh, I'm not gonna take the baseball bat. Uh, heck is that? Oh. Oh, handguns, ammo. Oh, X to swap weapon. Okay. Uh. Oh, we got a we got a hole we can jump down in here. All right. This is nice. A uh, little place to hide. Oh, more pipe. Man, we, we've got a pipe. I'm good with the pipe. I'm good with the pipe. There's no mercy for sinners and outcasts? Uh, yeah, yeah. I kind of understand that. Uh, I, I understand that. that. That is why I am moving the heck out of here. Try to stay quiet. Try to stay low in these bushes. That's a deer. I was like, what the heck is huffing over there? I love that there's a baseball bat up against a tree. Wait a minute. It's like, wait a minute. Why am I still carrying a stick? I said I don't need the stick. Okay, there's a dude over here. We're gonna try to be stealthy about this. There's still Peggy's all over, and if I shoot one of these pricks, they're probably going to uh, alert everybody and their freaking mama. Let's keep an eye on this guy. Just slowly sneak up, all sneaky like. What's he doing? That worked. That worked. Okay. I was kind of surprised. I didn't think I'd be able to reach over the wood pile and take him out, but we took him out. We beat him like a wet noodle. All right. Oh, there's more Peggy's down there. I think we should keep going this way. Might be a good idea. Keep Mr. Pipe out. Hear you. I think I lost him. I see uh what is this? Next to a long bridge. I'm gonna try and get inside. If anyone's still out there, listen. If anyone's still alive. Uh alright. He 
said he got to a trailer. I said, I see the general direction. Let's go get at that trailer. All that, all that cardio is paying off. I can run like no tomorrow. Alrighty, here we go. Oh, bullets. Anything that looks like a weapons crate, I'm clicking on it. All right, what's in here? Is there anything in this? Is there anything in here? Anything I may have missed? Anything I may... You know, let's pick up, let's loot everything. Shinies, gotta find shinies. Really? Oh, Seriously? Jesus Christ. Seriously? Brooke, I'm sorry. I thought they got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Check the room, Rook. Uh, yeah, that, there's a few people obsessed with somebody in there. Uh, uh, look at all these pictures of these chuckle fucks. Look at all these pictures of these guys. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. I had no idea. You literally saw the compound, the dude. You oh, were warned. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, we gotta arm ourselves. Here. Love how he gives me the AR. All right. And by that, I mean There's automatic there. rifle. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it. We're gonna head northeast. Not Armalite. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula. And then we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard. We should have come with the National place. Guard in the first place, dude. Okay. They tried to warn you. I didn't sign up for this. I just thought, you know, go be a deputy in a small ta a small county in the middle of nowhere. Do some fishing. Worse than have to deal with some drunk on a tractor. But no. Okay, come on. covering you this thing has got shitty range oh Jesus wait wait ah he's bored get out alright time to get out here shooting at me okay nice work back there i'd be dead if it weren't for you yeah and we're all going to be dead because of you dude smart we don't know who we can trust well yeah yeah nancy nancy's on on their side too Myself up. You're not helping me here. Ow. Okay. Now what? Is that a fucking plane? Don't you tell me they have fucking air support. Oh, really? Oh, 
my god, I'm running out of med kits. And, and... Oh, come on! I have shot that guy to the... Ah, oh, that worked. Cows. Well, I mean, that's friendly fire on their part. I'm out of dynamite. Shoot. intense opening action sequence here. I'm digging it. Of course, we wouldn't be in this situation if he had just listened to the sheriff in the first place. Could have gone. We could have come up back with backup. Oh, yeah, sure, sir. Just swim out and leave me behind after you said I saved your life. I see how you are. I see how it is. I see how it is. I see how it is. Ah, <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, jeez. Oh, well, that, I don't think he's with them. Oh, come on. You are my children. And together. Luke, I am your father. You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. Look, Heisenberg. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. Hey, look. It's the guy who cooked meth in that TV show. Means we're all fucked. He probably does cook meth in real life here, because, uh, yeah. Kind of looks like a place you'd cook collapse. meth in. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it. For years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, you sure oh. shit kicked. Oh, uh, well, uh, wait, no, see, I moved here. Hold on a second. I moved here to get away from the city, just Smart live as a small town deputy. Do. Then they the came along. I didn't kick nothing. Sorry. You're not going to hand me over to him, are you? No, yep, that right there says you're not going to hand him over. Hand me over to him. And I'm, I'm guessing that name tag means your name is Dutch. So you are literally probably the first nice Dutch it seems that I've ever met. Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. Mm, yeah, you think? There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. And I came and saw. We can unfuck this situation. I, I honestly don't think that we can. I honestly don't think that we can. Uh, all right. Let's see here. Uh, let's make some choices. Okay, we're going to go with this. We're going to make them about that dark. See, they really need a good... Ubisoft needs to put in a good bald head. 
they don't really have one. They're like, oh, well, here, you know, you've got like about two days worth of hair growth. They don't give you a bald head. We'll go with, uh, that's a little bit, eh, that's a little bit too military. A little bit too, uh, uh, a little bit too, well, no, actually, that's just a, eh, nah, nah, we're gonna stay with that. We'll stay with this look. All right, confirm. Okay, so lower by, we'll keep these pants. I like those pants. This shirt just screams America. But, uh, we'll go with, well, I, I like the sleeveless. I like that color, though. Headwear. You know, no, we're not going to go with headwear. And, really? This dude put on skeleton gloves because he just happened to have skeleton gloves. Nah, we're not going to go with any gloves. There's no need. All right. So we got cigarettes and cigars. Don't even want to know what those cow those uh are for. Wait a minute, what we got over here? Oh, we got a med kit. We're gonna need we're gonna need those. We are so gonna need those. Look at this. Yep. Knew it. Cooking meth. Look at this. Look at this. Chemical formulas. Mixed in stuff. Yeah, he's cooking meth. Oh, what do we got? What do we got over there? That was where we were. Okay. It's our bedroom. Cozy. Cozy uh, little bunker set up here. He's yelling at somebody or something. What do we got over here? There's a shovel. Oh, that's the exit. Okay. We ain't going there yet. Not yet. I don't think we can leave yet. Whoever's in the prison, are you there? Oh, wait. What well, we got over here? It says, Dear Mr. Roosevelt, I'd like to interview you about your recent altercation with government officials over your right to collect rainwater. My understanding is you had applied for a permit, but it was overturned, leading to your nights in jail and ongoing court case. I'd like to confirm your official statements to the court that water is a God-given right and the government stealing our resources out from under us. It's up to us to defend our individual rights and liberties. Also, did you really tell the judge, yeah, you bet your lily white ass I'm in contempt of you? Please let me... Okay, you know what I, I'm going to say right now? The idea that you cannot collect your own rainwater for your own water is stupid. And it's really not the government that's 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 stopping you. It, it it really is the companies like Nestle and others that take the water and bottle it. But uh, I'm gonna leave that at that. Uh, I got your message. Good to hear they're dropping the charges. Oh, that's awesome. We'll try to come out for partner summer. Ricky wants to show you how he's riding training wheels, but Ann's got a lot of work at the college. Uh, okay, that's that's from the kids. That's from the kids. That's fine. I'm, I'm like reading all of his private stuff here. Like if he saw me doing this, he probably... Look, it would not be complete without a big bass mounted on a wall above a fish tank. I'm just saying. What's this one? Richard Dutch Roosevelt served two nights in jail for contempt of court after contesting his right to collect rainwater in what the state has defined as a re as reservoir. He was collecting, he probably was collecting it in a freaking pond. Uh, can I push the button to use it? Um, maybe I can't. Okay, never mind. Oh, we got anything good in here? Oh, we got more handgun ammo. We can never have enough ammo. There is no such thing as too many bullets. I'm just gonna say that right now. Well, this guy's been. This guy been all up on uh, looking in these dudes. 
Okay, so there's a Jacob seed, the soldier, oldest brother of the siege of the seeds. He's he's a seed. In charge of training their militia up in the White Tail Mountains. Only things he believes in is sacrifice the weak. Seems to be running a few psychological experiments up north, all sorts of nightmare stories about people turning on one another at the drop of a hat. He's been linked to the creation of the monster wolves up north. The cult calls judges. Oh, isn't that awesome? Okay. Oh, who's this guy? John Seed, the Baptist. John the Baptist. Gee, that, yeah, that, yeah. Youngest of the Seed brothers and maybe the most sadistic. Oh, interesting. In charge of recruiting for the cult. Marking, cleansing, confession, and atonement. Yeah, that always goes well. Those are the four steps he puts everyone through to become a member of Eden's Gate, if they survive. You gotta survive. John tells everyone to accept the power of yes as a way to get his followers to do whatever the expletive, being good for YouTube, he wants. Great A psychopath. Yeah, he, he sounds like it. And who are you? Faith, the siren. Don't know how she's related. Seemed like she just showed up one day. She'll spin you a sob story, but Faith is a liar and a manipulator. She'll poison your mind with bliss if you give her the chance. Anyone who goes wandering into the Henbane River winds up either dead or walking the path to become one of those brain-dead angels going all the, doing all the cult's hard labor. Why are the angels doing the hard labor? All right. And Joseph. Joseph Seed. Leader of the project at Eden's Gate. He believes a great collapse is coming and thinks of himself as a modern-day Noah. Uh, Noah gathered two of every kind of animal, if it's to be believed, and he put them on an ark. He didn't arm them. I mean, really. Thanks God speaks to him. Yeah, of course he does. Told him to save as many souls as he can. Sure, Jan. Now that he started the reaping, his followers are willing to die for him. Well, pfft. He's had his people build three massive bunkers to protect themselves when his prophecy comes true. Guy's an absolute nut job. Yeah, well, you know, we kind of met the dude. I, I'm in prone to agree. Okay, what we got over here? Check, check. Oh, this is the, you ready the map. To All right, let's talk, to, let's talk to him. I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Do you think? Gather is that your partners are alive for now? Seems they've been split up, each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back? I get it. I get it. I got friends that've been taken too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. Well, there's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just. We need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're gonna do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. Gun, map, safe, got it. Oh, we got a key to something. Oh, it's everything's crawling with Peggy's. I'm oh, well, there we go. Oh, that's what that 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 got it. This is oh, this is where the this is where the magic happens. This is where we make guns, people. Where we make Look at all that. Place to make ammo. What is this? Dad, we aren't gonna be visiting anymore. Last time was the last straw. We said we didn't want Ricky shooting, but you just won't listen. He could have killed himself. Hey, you're gonna shoot your eye out, kid! My son isn't going to grow up thinking the end of the world was right around the corner. He's five and he's having nightmares about nuclear war. What the expletive is wrong with you? I thought we were past this, but you never change. Anne's taking a job down in Texas and I'll be able to find work down there easy. I won't be sending your address. Or address. You are address. I'm sorry, Dad. I hope someday you can find the help you need. Like, I... I you, you know? Okay, I get it. He, he was... This dude's a prepper. He's been a prepper. He lives in a bunker. A little bit screwy. Looks like the dude from uh, from from that TV show that made meth, Breaking Bad or whatever it was. But, uh, you know, given what we just went through, I'm glad he's a little bit cuckoo. Ooh, that's bright. 
Oh, 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 ow. Oh. Oh. Now listen up. If you're gonna build a resistance, there's some things you need to know. There's four ways you can go about this. First, you can liberate any hostages the cult's taken. These are good people who might just fight alongside you if you help them. Second, you can destroy Eden's Gate property that's all over the place now. Hell, they built two goddamn shrines on this island alone. You can tackle resistance missions. There are a lot of folks out there waging their own war against this cult. And they could sure use your help. And last, if you're really looking for a fight, you can take on the cult outposts that have popped up across the county. Liberating those places will give the resistance solid footholds to push back against Eden's Gate. Alright, so rescuing civilians, destroying cult properties, completing missions, and liberating cult outposts. Got it. I've got cameras set up all over this island. I'll keep an eye out for anything useful. For now, head south and take out any culture you see. And help any folks in need, would you? Don't you? Maybe. Oh. Uh oh. We got we got crazies here. There's some peggies. There's some peggies. Alright, kid, open your weapon wheel. Uh. Oh, that is a lot of. Okay. Okay, I see how it works. Okay, I get it. I get it. Come on, a little help here, please. Thanks for saving my sorry ass. These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. Oh, over, oh, a prepper, a prepper stash, huh? Okay, okay. We'll keep that in mind. Thank you for telling us about that. That was some, that was some helpful advice. Wait a minute, is there anything up in this tree stand? We got anything up here? Let's see if we get some high ground. See if we see anything. What we got? We got, like, this dude sat up here and just drank beer, smoked cigarettes, and, and watched the sun go down, I'm guessing. Alright, nothing up there. Oh, there's a tower up here. Let's go to, let's go check this place out. As it is, really pretty. It's really pretty. So this is why I moved out here. I moved out here to get away from it all. Smell of fresh air. Nice sunshine. I move out here to be dealing with these, uh, to be only dealing with religious fanatics. Sir, get out of my way. Okay, so we've got the map. There's a cult shrine there. It's Dutch's bunker. It's a prepper stash. Hey, Henry. I'm at the edge of the woods near where you spotted the fire sign. I don't know what that showboater was doing buzzing the treetops, but the sky is now clear air traffic. That smoke plume is pretty thick, but I need a closer look. What I can't figure out is what all these Peggies are doing out here. There's a whole bunch of them in the woods, calling out like they're looking for someone. I, I don't know if they're involved, but they seem pretty crusty and... Holy hell! A pickup just drove by like nobody's business, and the Peggies in the back are all carrying rifles and shotguns. I'm gonna... Holy shit! Well, I think that she just, she was, uh, talking about what we were doing. Uh, what happened to us? Uh, I mean, is there anything that you found in there worth, worth taking, sir? Is there anything? Oh, I don't have it. Okay, I'm gonna need that. Because we don't have any kind of melee right now. Now we do, but... I love this. I'm, I'm like totally. That's totally Hollywood right there. Okay, we gotta get in. Gotta get inside. Hey, Mike. I tried to get into the underground stash, but a pipe burst and flooded everything. I have no idea what's still salvageable. 
We need juice to run the pump to drain the water. I know the power switch is in the boathouse, but it's locked and you didn't leave me the key. So I'll leave that to you. Aww. Okay, there's a boathouse. Can you open it? Oh, wait. We can loot this. Hey, we got 19 bucks. We got money. I like money. So, now, see, wait a minute. The guy says, you didn't leave me the key to the boathouse. Alright, it's a boathouse. That means that... No, I mean, I'm, I'm swimming right now. I didn't mean to dive in there yet. Let's see here. Oh, we got lupine. We, we found flowers, so obviously there's going to be some crafting. Look at all the fish jumping. Is there fishing in this game? Okay, anyways. Now, he w it was like, I'm going to leave this all to you, right? He couldn't have gotten in the water, swam around, and of course swam up under and into the boathouse. And obviously there's no boat, so somebody was here. Like, seriously, sir. Oh, yeah, another med kit. Those are, those are always hand... I didn't want the boat paddle. I, I really didn't want the boat paddle. But I'll take it. If, if somebody needs paddling, we'll be paddling them. Okay, we got the water turn or get the we got the power up. That got us out out here. Oh god, that freaking Ubisoft, why you gotta blind me like that? They need to put they need to add like sunglasses, and when you put them on, they actually work. Okay, so we gotta turn on the pump. That's draining that. That's opening that. The water's going down. All right. Oh, and, oh, nice of us to have a flashlight. Oh, I wait. The boat paddle is a separate weapon. Hold on. Wait. What is this? What is this? I'm carrying. I have three different forms of melee. One of which is a paddle, and the other is a pipe. Oh, did, is that special? Oh, there's special ammo, too? Okay. Oop, didn't mean to do that. Is there anything in here? Oh, this flashlight's too damn bright. Oh, fasteners. Hey, we need food. Oh, there's a bunch of cash. Cash money. Okay. Crafting. Craft Molotovs and explosives in the weapon. Blah, blah, blah. Select a slot to select the explosive. Craft. Okay. Okay, so Q. Uh. Where is the explosive? Oh, okay. Okay, so under weapons. I don't see the ability to craft dynamite. Oh, there we go. Craft it. Okay, okay, I got it. They got a bow. This is some Rambo shit. I dig it. How many? I got ten arrows. I think we'll go. We're gonna we're gonna try out the. Uh, we're gonna try out the bow. Oh, it's still bright. Give me sunglasses, people. Okay, so we we've cleared the prepper stash. We have ourselves a bow and arrow. Uh, what we got over here? Oh, we got we got a cult shrine up there. We got a cult shrine. Taking out those will help us build la resistance. Viva la resistance! Uh, Bo is gonna be all stealthy and quiet like. 
Totally not John Rambo. Totally not John Rambo. All right. Here we go. Here we go. I see preppers I, I, or Peggy's preppers, whatever. Peggy's preppers are all the same thing. Okay, let's see here. Oh, they, the least I can do is make the, uh... Okay. The bow and arrow is, is no, no bueno. No bueno. Okay, where he, did he drop? Where's his rifle? Did he, oh, maybe the other dude did. Yeah, I mean, I, I kind of didn't expect it to be that great, to be honest. Yeah, it, it, it was not good. I mean, probably if I had scored a headshot. Probably if I had scored a headshot, but uh, yeah, we didn't. We're 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 going for the for the AR. We're going for the AR people. Much better. We ain't hunting. Okay, so this. Wonder if can I pick up that med kit? Yes, I can. Oh, we got more nitro. Um, I'm guessing we shoot the big red thing. That worked. It go boom. Shit, kid. I just saw the cult grab a guy down by the docks. You help him out, and maybe he'd be willing to pick up a gun and return the favor. Uh, yeah, um, you know, you're asking me to do a lot here, sir. I just, I, I am now, I'm now literally out here killing people, destroying many churches. I didn't shoot him. I got remote explosives out of that. Uh, I guess I did shoot him, so... No. Yeah, no, you're not gonna bleed out, sir. <laughs> I, 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 I did accidentally shoot you, but I guess we'll just go with that. Um, but we'll, we'll go with uh, the godsend part. We'll go with that. All right, sir. Sir. Sir, uh, can we talk? I, I guess he doesn't want to I guess he doesn't want to talk to me. I mean, I did accidentally shoot him What are you what are you doing? Can I talk to you? Hello? Do I have to shoot you again? Wait a minute you walked all that way I've got a bone to pick with that cult Hey, he walked the all that way station. Okay. All right. We we have that goal, but I think I saw. Uh, I think I saw. Yeah. Look, there's another cult shrine. There's another shrine over here. The people built shrines. They built shrines that are pumping out some green shit. Bullets pumped into him. This is a little bit silly. It's a little bit silly that I shot him that many times.
You're not making a move. Oh, is this really? Ow. Ow. Sir, like, you know, Dave, can you help here? I guess I should have probably moved closer. I didn't realize that a, ra a, a rifle that should have at least a 300 meter range was that bad. That's okay. I literally I was shooting from across there I hit that guy so many times and he still didn't go down I mean granted it wasn't really center mass or to the head but hey we got a med kit and then I couldn't shoot this thing from that far away I mean come on anyways back to back to business we have uh, blown up another Peggy shrine we have killed more Peggy's all the Peggy's all the dead Peggy's no we got more rifle ammo okay now we can go deal with that uh, that strat that spot over there the forest research station okay I want to make sure how to dive underwater By the way, I mean, just just the reality is, is that place is so close. They should have been able to hear. That's hard to come by nowadays. They should have been able to hear those shots. If they didn't hear those shots, I mean, kind of like, yeah. Okay. Slowly but surely, we're gonna sneak up. I see a Peggy over there. There's lots of Peggies. G to order your gun for hire to move the target. G to order your gun for hire to attack the targeted enemy. Undetected. Okay, so he'll try to stay stealthy. Okay, let's see what we got here. We got Peggy's, Peggy's, Peggy. I think there was a. I thought I saw a Peggy down on the dock. Uh. I will fuck him up good. Sends sends my gun for hire to deal with one guy. Smokes the rest because I am Batman. Putting out the research station. Peggy's won't be back after the ass whooping you just laid on him. We'll are you sure about that? Stick around and see if any folks are left alive. Gotta take what the dead don't need. Well, I mean, yeah. More more uh, more bullets. I like bullets. I like money and I like ammunition. Shop ammunition. Oh wait, wrong game. Never mind. Good Ignore that. Good okay, over here. Um, this is how it ends for me. No, sir, because I am Batman. Seriously, thank you. There, you are freed. You are free. Jeez, and we thought the guy that I was. The, oh my God, we thought. Wait, hypofison. Let's just pause on it. Some kind of like freaking like dog medicine, animal medicine. These guys mixing up like are they mixing ketamine and stuff? Feel sorry for those who went down that road. It's the cult's been creeping around the island for weeks. Looks like they're Gee, trying to set up a base of operations at the old ranger station. This workplace has gone 26 days without an accident. That's kind of scary. The reaping has begun. The Father has commanded us to raise these shrines throughout the region to spread his words. Once it is built, the sinners will try to deface it. We must defend these structures at all costs. We build these shrines so the Father's wisdom will take root and grow. You know, there was a weird green gas that was coming from those shrines. I think they're all on drugs. All right. 
So there's a ranger station. Let's go see about this ranger station that the Peggies are setting up shop at. It's super hazy. I lived in places that were hazy. They were never this hazy. The sun's out today. Thank you, Captain Obvious. I mean, the sky... I can't even... Oh, nope. There's some blue sky. I was going to say, next thing you're going to tell me, the sky's blue. Then I looked up and it was kind of white because it's hazy. Can you be a little bit more quiet, sir? You're making a lot of noise there, sir. Come over this way, please. That's, I think this is the ranger station. Yeah, it looks like a ranger station. Oh, we discovered a ranger station. Look at this. So basically, we are not going to get the National Guard. Our, our martial buddies have been captured. It's up to us to raise a resistance. So overwhelming forces. What's well, going to be? Okay. Yeah, well, gee, I think. In the wide world of sports was that <laughs> I shot her backwards and she flew into the air she was abducted by aliens there's aliens calling it now we found aliens seriously thank you I don't believe in luck but holy shit I should be dead well, yeah, you should be. Wish there was a way. I can't thank you enough. Look like I'm getting All right. Okay. What do we what do we got in here? Let's see what's what Hey Lance. What was that? Not sure what to advise. The seats don't have any claim to the property. The station is built on federal land after all. But if their people are traipsing around the area and, did you say, taking measurements and such? Anyway, those folks from Eden's Gate could potentially be charged with trespassing. I know they're kind of weird and unsociable, but I think if you give them a harsh word and a hard stare, they'll back off. Right. Dude, I mean, that's literally famous last words right there. We we know how 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 dangerous these nut jobs are. Is there anything worth taking in here? No, there's there's nothing to take in here. What do we got here? Hey, we got a map. Okay. I I'm totally not responsible for the fact that that music is playing on the radio. Thank you, Ubisoft, for putting that in the game. Okay, let's move. Maybe we brought this on ourselves. But I mean, I, I'm not going to say a word about what we did or didn't do. Okay. Not going to say a word about what we did or didn't do. I have zero knowledge of why these people have gone crazy. Trust me. I promise you that. Um, yeah. No idea. Not a single clue. All right. We got to go to the radio tower. I believe we got to get this radio tower back online. Oh. Loot, loot, loot and scoot. There's something in there. I can't get inside of there. Wait, can I get inside of there? Is there? Sir, you are blocking my path and harshing my mellow. All right. Can I climb up here? Oh, I can climb up here. I mean, nope, what? Oh, come on. I 
I see stuff inside of there. I want what's inside the building. What the heck is that? There's something way over there. How is it that there's something way over there? Yeah, whatever. Everyone here has owned something small at one point or another. Being handy gives you an edge. You're always needed by someone for something. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. That, you're right, yeah, being handy. Yada, yada. Quit trying to make small talk. Just keep your eyes peeled for Peggy's. Alright, climb the, climb the radio tower. I know what you're thinking, and no. I ain't gonna have you climbing towers all over the county for me. So don't you, worry. You, yes, you are. Also, try not to fall from up there. You're probably gonna have me climbing towers all over the county, because it's the only way you're gonna be able to speak to me. Blood's from a long ways away. Alright. Hey, it's pretty. Hey, we leveled up. We level. We liberated Dutch's Island. Hey, deputy. I'm getting a strong signal now. Let's open up your map. I'll walk you through what I'm hearing. Now let's look at the big picture. Assume your map out so we can see the whole county. Now, Hope County is divided into three regions. To the north, you got the Whitetail Mountains. It's run by Jacob Seed, oldest brother of that fucking family. Jacob's the one training the cult, and he's damn good at what he does. Eli and the Whitetail Militia have been trying to hold out, but Jacob's ready to step on their necks. Southeast of there, you got the Henbane River. That's Faith's territory. The little sister. I've heard all sorts of stories about people losing their minds in a place called the Bliss. Now, head west to the Holland Valley. John Seeds just rolled in there and has taken everything in the name of the cult. Food, supplies, and worst of all, people. Now, they're gonna have plenty more calls all over the county. I'll keep you posted on anything that'll be useful. Okay, so... Forcing them to confess their sins are also taking food and animals to prepare for the collapse. Is it falls end is the heart of the resistance. So I think I think this might be where we're going first. Fog should be clearing soon, which means we can get you off this island. You Sit mean tight. fog has be been keeping me on this island. You're kidding me, right? Fog has been keeping me on this island. Centers. Every one of us. Look, it's Ryan Reynolds. You, me. <laughs> Even the father knows deeply of sin. It's a poison that clouds our minds. What if I told you you could be free from sin? What if I told you that everything you ever dreamed for just not three easy payments of 1995 would be overcome if you embraced? He looks like Ryan Reynolds. Freedom from sin can come from the power of just one word. He really does. Yeah. Ah, shit, they got Hudson. I am a sinner. Yes. I wish to be unburdened. Yes. I must be. Watching this, know that you have been selected. You will be cleansed. You will confess your sins, and you will be offered atonement. Don't worry. You don't have to do anything. We'll come for you. Welcome to Eden's Gate. All right. He's threatening me. Fuck. John C's got your partner Hudson. She's 
in a world of shit, kid. You gotta get going. All right. Quick, we gotta get, we gotta get off of this. Yeah, we know where to go. We know where we're going next. Hey, kid. I marked three locations to your map to get you started. Lumber Mill up north, the Hope County Jail to the east, and the town of Falls End to the west. Now it's your call. But if I were you, I'd start with Falls End. All right, you, you, you're telling me, hold on here. Where are you saying I should go first? Falls End. I'm tracking this, wait, where is this, where is this mission taking me? It's taking me in that direction. Where am I? Okay. So it's taking me towards this one. Alright, so I'm here in Falls In. This is where I need to start. And uh we got Ray Ray over at Pumpkin Farm having issues. But for right now, this is where we're gonna call it, ladies and gentlemen. This is where we're gonna pick up. Okay, save. I don't even know if it has saved. Okay, I guess it has. We're gonna trust that it has. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining me for the first episode of Far Cry 5. So many Peggies, so little time. Thank you for joining me. If you've enjoyed watching, please do hit the like and subscribe button. We have more Far Cry 5 coming to you next week. And join us Monday through Friday as we stream a little bit of Diablo 4 and a little bit of Elden Ring. Uh, right now, that's what we're doing. Have a great day, everybody, and we'll see you soon.